it's now the start of August. Now this isn't normal bee swarming season. Nevertheless, one of our hives has swarmed today and I have managed to capture it. Now, it's swarmed because basically the seasons, the weather is all out of kilter. This year we've had a very dry and mild winter, which was in part warmer than the wet and cold spring that we had. And we're now into summer, allegedly, so it is a little bit better. But the bees have swarmed in response to the rather odd weather conditions. We're not the only people who are experiencing autumn swarms, uh, sorry, August swarms. We've had other uh, beekeepers reporting similar as well. Nevertheless, we have captured the swarm and instead of using the usual bucket and box or box method with the sheet on the ground, we've used a new bit of kit to capture it. Well, this is the bee box that we've bought and the lid comes off and instead of shaking the swarm into a cardboard box or a bucket and then overturning it on a sheet on the ground, we simply shake the whole swarm into uh, the box and then put the lid on. Now, I say whole swarm, there'll be plenty that uh, don't uh, get into the box and it, on the side of it is a small hole and we'll see if we can just zoom in on that but it's a hole that's big enough to be able to let the bees in. There it is. And there's some gauze on the outside as well to allow for ventilation but basically what happens is that if the queen is in the box the other bees will follow her in and it looks very much as though that's happened because most of the bees have now that, that were not captured straight into the box have now gone into it and then later on today we'll tape up that hole and take it down to our other apiary and put it into a new hive. Well it's now about four hours since I first put the bees into the box and what we're going to do is tape up the hole at the front, uh, at the end of it there, uh, some duct tape. We've put a bit of duct tape on the uh, that side as well just to make sure that no bees get uh, stuck to it on the other side of the hole and we just carefully put that over and I'm going to use some duct tape to tape down the lid as well because there are awful lot of bees in there and it feels quite heavy uh, and we're going to shift these in the car down to our other apiary. Uh, the roof of the box. The others are from what bother yet. Yeah, we'll, we'll get that done now. Right. Brush them away from this edge. Mm -hmm. There's still a few in the, um, in the yes, box. Yes, well, that's alright. Just brush them away from the edge.
Right, get the back of and get that super over here for here. Right, are you ready? Yeah. Ready? Right, go. So there we go, that's the new hive now set up with the swarm uh, brought here in our very own bee box.